Uh, it started to bust down raining. What is good, my guys and girls of YouTube? It's your boy Justin Omoi, and I'm here with the with the video for you guys and girls on something that came through. Long story short, I went on the channel. I was like, "Yo, this is dope. I want to show my people." And then I emailed them. They said, "Yo, yo, 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 this thing's not cut. What's really good?" Yo, there's a lot of peanuts in here. Oh, sh here it is. Oh my god, this is so tight. Colors. There you go. It says Logic Keyboard. Not Logic the Rapper, but this is a nice box. I can't even lie. I gotta find that knife again. So let's see what's in here. Of course, there's a keyboard in there. Spoiler alert. Oh my god, this magnet is strong. But, oh! They look nice. So here is the keyboard around plastic. Oh, it comes with a rubber um, skin. Rubber skin, you know? Some of y'all may know what that is. We got a wet cloth in a, in a, what is this called? The pouch? Pouch. Cleans accumulations of food, drink slash waste, or drink waste, grease, sweat, dust. Yo, they know me too well. Ooh, a nice little cutout piece of paper that they printed. Experience our color coded shortcut reference guide at logickeyboard.com forward slash shortcut. But look at this. This is all the shortcuts. I know you can't see it clear. My bad. It has 10 billion keystrokes per key or manufactured. So if you hit these keys like 10 billion times, you know, each key. That's its lifespan right there. All right, let me change the angle for y'all because this is not justice. <laughs> All right, my guys and girls, here is the keyboard and yo, it looks so stunning. Let me see if I can give you a better lighting because this, oh my God, bro. You see how it looks all liney liney? It's actual straight lined out um, texture. This keyboard is meant for FL Studio, as it says here, designed for FL Studio. This is going to be all the shortcut keys that's in FL Studio, or at least 99.9%. .9%. I, I, I haven't really counted all of them, to be honest. But this is for you guys and girls who wants to learn about FL Studio, or who wants to have all the shortcut keys just planted on the keyboard. So just in case you want to learn, or be like, okay, this is how you do, I don't know, claw machine, bam. It's all here for you. This definitely saves your time when taking your mouse, finding the, the button you want to press, like the uh, multi-link or link controller button, uh, the countdown button, three, two, one. I didn't even know that was control P for that. So on. These keys are worked out in a fashion where they have circle, colored circles, like pink, pink and purple, and blue. That's control, shift, alt, control, control, shift, alt. So for example, you want to quick quantize, you hold control and press Q for the quantize. It quickly uh, quantizes it if it it's in the snap. Control S is save, control shift S is save as. So if you want to save it like a uh, zip file instead of FLP or OGG or MCC, FCC won't let me be. Some of y'all may be wondering, why are they different colors? Like these colors over here are blue, light blue. This one's yellow, this one's orange, blue, green pink up here if you can see pink well these color coatings have to deal with the windows that you're in or the um style the style so for a great example you can see these orange ones are actually all the ones pertaining to the playlist or the piano rolls um tools so z is zoom c is a cut b is a brush got a nice little fl studio icon there shouts out but look at this there's light here this is a light up keyboard i did not tell y'all that but now y'all know all right a couple more things before i show you the light up keyboard this has two usb slots one over there one over here so like come out and it needs two usbs to plug into the computer to you know access the keyboard which is a gray one and to have those two extra usb slots so you can put like a wireless mouse there, which I'll be doing, and then an extra slot for, I don't know. I'm going to plug it in, by the way, my uh, little USB here, if you can see it sticking out. That's for my mouse. One, and, oh, oh, look at that, son, look at that, look at that. It shines through, let me turn off the light. Yo, 
the keys light up. The, 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 I like that right here. You can see it's lighting past it. Yo, this looks so freaking... Yo! It's almost like a uh, washed up pastel kind of feel. <laughs> it's pretty tight. Oh, it feels so clickety click click or not clicky clicky. It feels so chick chick clicking chick clicking. It's not like a mechanical keyboard. Backlit logic keyboard signal as tight. Also shows you the cap locks. It's not as bright but not as a problem anyways. I'm gonna go ahead and put on that rubber that it gave us and see if it looks any better or worse or how it feels. It kind of takes away from the clarity. It kind of makes my eyes blurry. Okay, okay, it looks better now. Okay, you just gotta rub it on a little bit. It's okay, it's like, it's doable with the rubber on it. So yeah, if you want the rubber on it, you can put it on if you don't want it. And here's the button for the backlight. As you see, you want to, one, two, three, four, five. There's like five modes for it. Alright guys and girls, after using this thing for about a good 30 minutes, definitely <laughs> it's pretty fun to use, to look at, even looking at. Um, feels nice for the hands when it comes to working with the applications, uh, FL Studio, I did type as you've seen. Feels fitting for the fingers, it's definitely not something for gamers or people who want to just be with games, but it is for people who want to use FL Studio and have the best of their capabilities annoying what shortcut keys are or how to use it. Big shout out to the homies Casper and Lori from Logic Keyboard for sending this over here for actually letting me get it and show y'all. So yeah, that's it. The Logic Keyboard for FL Studio 12. I'm sure it'll work for FL Studio 13 and so on when the time comes. Maybe they'll send the new sh uh, space button that says design for FL Studio 13. I don't know. So yes, thumbs up the video if you enjoyed this one. Subscribe to your boy if you want to learn about music, how to make it, the equipment, different terminologies, so forth. My name is Justin Omoe, and with all that said, peace. I'm out.